Many chameleon species experience a dry and wet season, sometimes two. We know the harsh dry season kills some species of chameleons to where they exist only in eggs under the ground. And in many places, chameleons hide under the rocks, in trees, or even burrow into the ground and curl up to try to survive the dry season. But during this time, when they are fighting for survival, they're also getting a rest. It becomes an interesting question for ourselves. How much of that should we be replicating? Should we ignore the harsh dry but still give the opportunity for a rest? Currently, the replication of wet and dry seasons in captivity is in its infancy. Generally, in captivity, chameleons get a mid-range between the wet and the dry seasons year-round, and it seems to be working. But some keepers are starting to seriously consider whether giving a brumation period, like Parsons chameleon keepers do for their animals, is a good idea. There's no conclusion here, just an open-ended question for us to continue working on providing an answer. This concludes our series on chameleon hydration. Follow Chameleon Academy to view the whole series. See you next week.